Hi, this is Kenda from Remaking June. This is my video tutorial on how to apply unique 3D fiber lashes. I've seen some readers mention that they have trouble getting the effect that they see um, on the advertisements, or it's a little thick, or they have some fallout um, underneath. And um, this is only my second time applying them. The first time I didn't have any trouble, so I thought maybe if I made a video and showed you that it really is possible to extend your lashes uh, with unique 3D fibers that it might help just a little bit. Now I'm going to do this without a base mascara. That's how I did it the first time. My eyelashes are pretty long to start with. Um, if you can see they're light on the ends, but they are pretty long. So I'm going to do it with no base mascara so you can see exactly what the Unique does by itself without any help of eyeliner or additional makeup. And of course the first thing you want to do is you want to start with your transplaning gel. That's the big one. And you just want to apply it just like regular mascara. And I'm only going to do one eye so you can see the difference. It looks just like regular mascara. And I always blink into the wand so I get a more even application. And while it's still wet, you want to take your um, fiber lashes. It's very important you do this while it's still wet. You can see it looks a little different. And you want to apply to the end. You don't want to apply it way down at the base because while that will make them fuller, you want to make sure you also hit the ends of your lashes so that it stretches the fibers out. Like that. And of course I'm talking in between so it's taking a little bit longer but it's really fast. So then to set them, you go back over with the gel. Let it dry for just a second. Nothing's falling off. As you can see, there's a little bit of gray under my eye. That's not the unique. That's um, that's Kenda not getting all the mascara off from yesterday. Now that it's dried a little bit, this is important. I see a lot of people trying this and they end up with like spiders around their eyes. This is your best friend. And I blink into it again. And that gives you a nice more natural look. It's a little bit harder to see for me right now where to separate um, since I'm taping this on my phone. This is before, natural, and this is with the unique 3D fiber lashes, no mascara. And you can see there is no clumps, um, no fallout underneath plenty of wrinkles, but no fallout. Um, and nothing on my finger. Nothing. Um, and still no fallout even after I messed with them. So I, I, I love these. It was so easy. Um, like I said, this took a, a few more minutes than it normally would because I was talking everyone through it. But really, seconds longer than your regular mascara. And now if I wanted to, I could go back over it um, with a regular mascara to make it darker and make it, the lashes stand out even more. But I don't even really think I need that. I can just go like this. And when I put them on yesterday, it lasted all day long. Before bed, I had to use a makeup remover and take them off myself. Um, I haven't tried sleeping in them yet, uh, but I have read that you can do that also. I think it's all in the technique. I think they look great. I love them. And uh, I think you will too.